Welcome to another video. In our video today, we are going to analyze a young prospect at Chelsea. This prospect is Cesare Casade. Cesare Casade has been one of the standout players at Chelsea during the preseason. Casade is rumored to be one of the best youngsters at Chelsea currently. Casade showcased his ability, his strengths, and his weaknesses during the preseason match, especially the preseason match between Chelsea and Wrexham. Casade is a young Italian midfielder currently at the age of 20. Cesare is just beginning his career in football and he has a lot to showcase for the team. In our video today, we are going to analyze his strengths and his strengths we are going to look at key metrics of his strength. The first key metric that we are going to analyze is his passing. Then we'll follow it with his dribbling. Then we'll analyze his vision and his defensive news. Stay with us in this video as we do an in-depth tactical setup of Cesare Casade. Before we continue, I'd kindly like you to like, share and subscribe to this channel for more videos like this. So, Cesare plays as a midfielder. He can either start as a central midfielder in a midfield three or play as a number 10. In the last game against Brighton, he came on as a substitution to play as a number 10. Cassade is also flexible and he can also play as a second pivot in the number 8 position, dropping to cover in for the advancing fullbacks who are pushing high up to attack. Casade is such a mobile player since he is able to also make runs in the half space and attack the half space as an inside forward. Casade's versatility is something that can bring a lot of tactical setup for Mauricio Pochettino. Casade is a young prospect who flourished in the under 20 World Cup. So, training of young players is key and Casade, since he wants to play for Chelsea, will have to undergo Mauricio Pochettino's vigorous training methods. Casade is good 
in training. That's why Pochettino has given him time. But Pochettino has said that all players need time to develop, time to improve, and time to grow. With the guidance of Mauricio Pochettino, who's a manager who's worked with young players and improved them, Casade's career looks to be going in an upward trajectory from now henceforth. Also, working under elite players such as Raheem Sterling, Nkunku, Modric and other senior players, he is likely to understand the game better and is able to get his best and natural position where he can contribute effectively. For an Italian midfielder has time to flourish and work under the best conditions and the best managers. He, we can also remember that he won the golden boot as well as he won the best player in the World Cup under 20. From here henceforth, Casade's career is looking to go in an upward trajectory. We wish him all the best at Chelsea as we look forward to see how he continues to integrate it with his new teammates. Thanks for staying with us. Thanks for watching.